Do you have any tips for people who would be dressing up for Halloween? How do they make themselves look really scary? Um, yes, secret gel blood. Find gel blood. If you're doing a zombie or anything or just you want to do uh, something that looks like really, really detailed and really disgusting, um, there's a product called gel blood. It's like a really thick blood that you use a, just like a little palette knife or something to put on, and it builds up um, like chunks, and it looks like you're just torn to shreds. I love using that stuff. If I'm like have 10 minutes to make somebody look really messed up, it's gel blood. You can take egg yolks and put them on your skin, and it won't hurt you, and let them dry and crack. And you can put, you know, you can get kind of like fun makeup at the local, you know, makeup store, or even at the drug stores they have Halloween makeup. Paint it underneath, put the egg yolk on, let it crack and like bleed through. The makeup will bleed through. It'll be really creepy and cool looking. Well, the traditional vampire is always a great thing, and Zombies are big this year, so with uh, Walking Dead, little little ash powder, some blood, good to go. You can take purple eyeshadow and make big dark circles around your eyes and put on really pale foundation exactly. and create like a cool vampire. And black eyeliner is good. We love black eyeliner. You can put it on your lips, too, for, for like black lipstick if you can't find black lipstick. But you know what? They always have black lipstick and like dark purple lipstick and fingernail polish around Halloween time that you can do really cool stuff with and they have black light stuff too that's really cool and you can even get like a little black light stick to walk around with so you can light yourself up in dark places. True, gelatin, just use uh, no, you know, regular Knox gelatin and then you get it so it's not so hot, brush a little on the skin, let it cool off and then you peel it off, you know, you don't want to put it on really hot, you let it get a little cool, let it dry and then I just peel it off, it'll look like chunks of flesh coming off your skin, which would be kind of cool. Blood. Blood is always a winner. <laughs> Just put more blood on it and it'll be terrifying. <laughs>